I do not need another camera. But if you find something ridiculous, jump on it. And these next cameras, which I picked up for zero money, I think are gonna be worth it in the future. I think they're worth it now. If I resell them, I'll get my money back. Just using them, having them, collecting them is gonna make me happy. So without further ado, let's unbox. Boom. So with these eBay finds, this particular deal, $25. That's the first camera, second identical to the first, and then the third camera there is an SLR, so a film camera. And then last but not least, we've got another digital camera. Sweet. Okay, so not one, but three Canon EOS 300Ds, or the KISS Digital. The Canon 300D, otherwise known as the Canon Rebel or the Canon KISS Digital. These cameras are so early 2000s, it is unbelievable. Released in 2003, they were kind of a pinnacle camera um, if you consider the, around about that time, the Nikon D1 was around as well. This was a prosumer aimed camera. It was aimed to storm the market, or the aim for Canon was for it to storm the market and to put it in the hands of prosumers. So people that um, have a little bit more money and want to take good quality pictures. It is a six megapixel beast with a CMOS sensor. So not CCD like I love, it has a CMOS sensor, but... This particular camera was aimed for the prosumer market. This actually had the EFS mount. I believe this was the only camera to do the EFS mount. Glass fits perfectly. I do not know if this camera works. So let's have a look. I already have the batteries from my um, other Canon cameras. I have a EOS 20D. Um, this is a battery from that. So let's pop it in and see what happens. Battery housing looks clean. Moment of truth. On switch at the top. We have lights at the back. It's saying no CF card. Guess what? I have a CF card. I have a bunch of CF cards. This is a 64 megabyte CF card, so it's huge. Card goes in the slot. Close the door. And let's see what happens. Oh my goodness. People, we have movement. Um, this was a 2003 released camera. It's a DSLR camera with a CMOS 6 megapixel sensor. I'm not a huge fan of CMOS from back then. I really like the CCD vibe. I already had the batteries for um, these cameras because I have a Canon collection. This is my EOS 20D. It works, I've got a nifty 50 on it. I'm gonna use the battery out of this. Have the battery, have the camera. Open the door on the bottom, insert my battery. Close the door, hopefully she works. Power's on, good sign. Glass already owned. Let's see if she works. Boom, one times working, KISS Rebel Canon camera. Now, side note, I tested the other two and they're a little bit quirky. So out of those three cameras so far, one of them works faultlessly, the other two are a little bit meh. So I've got one working camera and two parts cameras, which I might be able to get to work, we'll see. Either way, 25 bucks, still a good deal. The Canon Kiss Rebel was released in 2000 and insane. This was released for the prosumer market and it was released for, I believe, around $1,000 back then, which is probably like $2 million now, but $1,000. It was a six megapixel CMOS sensor. 
it is a six megapixel CMOS sensor. We've got a dial at the top with all of my favorite settings. Uh, we have your aperture priority, your shutter priority, your full manual. This particular camera is a DSLR Canon camera. What does that mean? It means I can interchange my lenses with all of my other digital Canon cameras from that era. This took an EFS mount, which I think is just unique to this camera, but the lenses from my um, other EOS cameras fit on this. So it's gonna go nicely in my collection. The body's plastic, pretty tough. It's also very, very light, which is a huge bonus. We have a video out, a digital, and then we have a remote port in the side, which is awesome. It has a pop-up flash, and which is super handy. Not too bright, but it gives you that nice effect indoors. Also helps to trigger your other flashes. So, $25 for one, two partially working DSLR cameras, which I'll probably be able to adjust. We'll see, I'll let you know, keep you posted. And one fully working, so 25 bucks. But we have a bonus. In the box was an SLR Canon camera. It is immaculate inside, immaculate. And it came with batteries, if you can see that. Um, so let's see if it works. Dial on the top, batteries are in. Boom, she's working. Takes the same glass as the Rebels that came in. The deal. Let's see if she works. Oh my goodness. Can you hear that? Auto focusing and firing. So a Canon SLR 35 mil uh, 2000s auto focusing, wonderful little, super lightweight, feels wonderful in the hands camera and a Rebel 300D, six megapixel CMOS sensor camera in the deal as well. So let's say $12.50 each. Why am I buying these retro cameras? Well, these early 2000s, late 90s, 80s vintage cameras are so cool. The nostalgia, the retro vibes, the feel of using them, it just makes me happy. And I'm a camera collector. I'm gonna put these downstairs in my camera collection. I'll take them out, I'll shoot them, I'll edit the shots and I'll post them. I print them out, I put them in my photo albums and it makes me happy. The feel you get from shooting these old, early, low megapixel cameras is so cool. It's slow, it's deliberate, it's almost like shooting film. Canon twins, old school legends, easy peasy prosumer cameras. These are just a drop in the ocean in my camera collection. I have boxes of cameras which I've not opened yet, things which I'm harvesting off the internet and things which I'm going to open and show you. My aim is to give you cameras that are less than $100, most of them are less than $20, uh, that you can go out and shoot. Thanks for hanging around with us, guys. I really, really appreciate you uh, signing in and watching the videos. You don't have to subscribe. You don't even have to like. Just go out and shoot some pictures. It makes me happy and I hope it makes you happy. Just a little teaser. Um, I have a bunch of cameras. I'm gonna give you a quick tour of what I've got. And then later on, you're gonna see some more videos of the types of cameras I've picked up. I'll show you how much I picked them up for and how I did it. Um, come and see my collection.